Hi there, viewers. We're back to show you some actions again this time around. It's going to be, of course, you see what I'm handling here, and you see that that's knife, and this is a stick. So, we want to see how it's possible for you to defend a knife, for a knife to run hand in hand with stick, and for you to be able to hold a stick and defend a knife attack comfortably. So, we're going to see how that works. Stay tuned and watch out. But before we get into action, our first timers always remember hit the bell, subscribe, and leave your comment for our already esteemed subscribers. Say so thumbs up. Stay tuned. Okay. Now, just like I always say that most of the actions you see here are taken with extreme care. Otherwise. If you're not careful with those actions, you'll see them as if they are just child's play. And when you go and they be careless over them, and you'll get somebody seriously and badly injured. So we are going to be very careful. This has to do with two basic weapons, a knife and a stick. Now, how are we going to defend this knife attack using a short stick as short as this? All right? Now, before we take a random move, he's going to strike. Now, when he strikes, you see the counter. Now, you're taking your go. Ready. Ready. Pop. That's it. One here. Now, this is one strike, and this is two strikes, and that is three. Now, how, why is it like that? The first strike goes, becomes one. This one is pop. It will relieve the grip of the knife. And this one, again here, is a bad strike. And this, you send him off. That is that. Just like I said, we need extreme care. One there, two there, and there it goes. Okay? Now, we want to see. Okay, somebody will ask a question. Is it only... This way that you can escape from this or you can counter this. No, we are going to use the reverse to show you that you can equally counter from the reverse action, the reverse side rather. Okay? Still coming that same way. Now go. One here, two there, and three here. Okay? You see that? We'll take it again. This has to do with two reverse sides. The first action, we took it from this end. Now, I said to, to satisfy some persons that I've asked you, is it only this angle that is possible for you to escape or to do to the counter? No, we've shown you that it can equally go from this angle. Okay, so let's take it, that angle one more time. Go. Come here, yeah, two there, and pop. That is it. All right. Now, let's take another line of attack. All right. Direct All right. Now, let's go. You see this? And that, and that. We watch again. Direct Goes one here, and I turn here, and I go past. Okay, one more action on the direct strike. Go. I should kill. Okay, go. Pam here. This one here. And turn it here. And then pam. Oh, there. Okay. That is it. Now, one will ask a question. Okay, is it that. Oh, grab the knife. Is it that that strike is not strong enough for the knife to go up the hand? Is strong enough, but like I said, if I do such strike here now, probably maybe you don't want us to continue showing you our actions anymore because it is not a, a clear thing, it is hard. So that's why I had to be a little bit soft on it, but that is it's hard. But when you are doing it out there, it has to be hard. Pop here is off now, pop, and then you take your action, all right? Okay. Last two. Now let's take, okay, let's see, take that same strike and 
do another variation of a counter. The same direct strike, then another variation. Go. I see this. Now with this, you take this down. Ha. And twist. Okay. Now watch that again. Another variation. He goes. Ah. Here. Step here and I step here. One and I twist this. Okay, let's take it one more time. Boyfriend, your boss is too poor. All right, girls. Stop. Boom. Boom. All right. Okay. Now, the last but not the least. Different strike from the knife. Now, done this, done straight. Now, let's see side. Coming from roundhouse. Yeah. Good. All right. That's it. Now we go. Now can you see this? From here. Now try to extend it. Mm -hmm. See that? Okay. You're feeling something there. Yes. Good. Now you have taken the range that from here. There's no way that knife can get you stuck here. Ah. And once that is done, you stop up and then step in with your kick. All right. Now with with that strike, this is called. Acupuncture. That strike here can separate the shoulder from the arm. Pop there. So once you stop, it, you mm. drop the strike there, pop, it will jack the hand. And definitely this grip will be losing. Alright? Let's take it one more time. The very last one. Let's go. See that? From here now, you land your kick. That takes him off. Because definitely that knife is no longer there with the maximum strike. Okay, now you've seen that action. I want to make us know like I keep doing one and the variation, one and the variation. So let's do another variation of these two. The first variation of this is you stuck it by the by the shoulder blade here, half so that it will affect the arm and the shoulder all together while stalking the, 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 the knife from penetrating or advancing to you. Now, how about taking that strike, the counter, straight to the throat? Can you see this? This is very dangerous because the strike, that strike there, you forget. It's down, it's gone. So you have to be careful. So I, I keep emphasizing that you have to be very careful. These techniques we are showing, they are not something that you play with. You don't joke with them. You have to be very, or you have to be in a serious danger before you can apply them actually the way they are. But first of all, this is just a process for you to understand that, okay, this can be done. That can be done, that can be done. So now when you are now in a real danger for you to apply it, you already know that, okay, this can be done. Now what do you do next is to apply the full force on it, that's all. Okay, so stay tuned. We're going to come back here, come your way next time with another action. So if you have any questions, comments, leave it at the comment section. We'll be glad to respond to you. And uh, for our new subscribers, please, do not hesitate. Subscribe, hit the bell, and we'll be glad you did. Thank you.